All right, hey guys, I'm Sniper Five here, and uh, first of all, I want to show you before I do uh, my review um, what I've gotten recently. It is the uh, GoPro Hero camera. I got this for 180 bucks um, off Craigslist. So if you're wanting to film your own videos, um, try to I mean look on your local Craigslist and just see what they have out there 180 bucks brand new these cameras are like cheapest like 300 so I mean this is a heck of a deal but yeah came with a head strap which is on um, which is the uh, mount that I'm gonna wear when playing paintball so yeah I'm super pumped about that cannot wait to get some footage but other than that I just got back from my local paintball shop I ordered this a while ago and it just now came here and just uh, Kind of a long story, but anyways, it's finally here. I am super pumped about this. Uh, this is the uh, Tipman TIPX. This is the second generation TPX. Um, comes in a nice hard case. And has a two-year warranty. Can't beat that. Um, so let's open this up. Man, I just got this and I just rushed on home. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Wow, it's a lot lighter than I thought it was gonna be, but um, yeah, it's it's pretty good size. Uh, you can see here that's a normal trash can. So yeah, that's about three quarters of the way up a uh, normal trash can. If that helps at all, that's pretty big. But uh, feels great. Um, yeah, comes with a uh, whoa super light magazine there's like nothing it's crazy anyways looks like we got a uh, barrel plug squeegee little thing of grease a little white thing got an o-ring and some allen keys manual pretty uh, thick manual but yeah anyways I don't care about that stuff. Get to the gun. Okay, where do we start? Oh man, I've been waiting so long for this gun. Um, let's start near the front. See right here, Tipman TIPX. And my camera is not focusing. Okay, this says X7 threaded. Um, this is an X7 threaded barrel. Yeah, I think it's six inches. The CO2 goes in here. All you gotta do is twist, pull up, and twist again. And you look in there. You can see the pierce pin in there. And then put the CO2 thing in there. Push down, twist, push down again, twist again. Like a zigzag motion. Uh, the CO2 canister goes in here and it is not pierced until you pull the trigger once. And it is, which is a very cool feature, because you could have a CO2 canister in there all day, not fire the gun, and take it out. And, hey, you got an extra CO2 canister. It's not pierced. So you're not wasting money, and it's not leaking. Um, right here's a safety. Safety's on. Safety's off. Right here, this little button right there is your mag release. Spring-loaded. Pop that back in there. It's kind of hard to get to because it's um, it's lower than the hand hand grip right here. So your finger, you kind of have to have it pointed and push down. But snap that back in there. Looks like we got a lanyard loop right here, or yeah, whatever a place to hook your lanyard into. Um, it's got a metal trigger, which is very very nice back here is your velocity adjuster right here and that right there is um, a place where you can drill out and install a remote line adapter which depending on how much I use this pistol I'm probably gonna buy um, but yeah so yeah I got this from my local shop for 220 bucks straight from Titman. Um comes with an extra mag seven round mags the true feed mags um, I heard the the original ones had a bunch of problems, so 
Huh. Oh, sorry. I was just kind of looking at this. You pull this down, and it locks right into place. And then, I don't know, somehow it unlocks. I don't know. Huh. Anyways, sorry. Um, but yeah, let's, uh, I think that's about everything. Uh, let's get to the shooting part of this video. Alright, GoPro test with the TIPX pistol. Shooting at that tree right there, about 20 feet away. Okay, first shot pierced it. Okay, little windows tell me there's nothing in there. Alright. So that was a uh, GoPro test of the Timmy TIPX.